There's an enemy chopper dropping off troops. I need to get over there fast so I can lay down and get ready to mow down some suckers. They won't know what hit them. So I'm going to crawl up here in the cover of this bush, scope out. There's only one guy. I only see one guy. Did the chopper really just drop off one guy? I don't believe that. So I'm going to look around. Maybe they all fanned out in different directions and I only saw one. But nope. There's a guy. There's a guy. I'm going to take him out. But there's a second guy. He stopped. He sees me. He is top priority, buddy. You're number one. Because you see where I am. Might have just hit me there, but that's okay. He's dead. I'm going to take out his friend there. There we go. The first guy got away, but that's okay. He is scared. I'm going to roll over here. Reload like a badass. And then I'm going to get up. And get out. Because my bush of tranquility has been compromised. It's time to move on to find a new sanctuary. Because this hill is pretty exposed. I'm trying to work my way up to the rocks at the top there to try and take hold of that. But it's going to take some effort. Especially with that chopper. That's an enemy chopper flying around. Blasting people in the face with missiles and rockets. I don't want to be his victim. Look at that. So close. It even moves the bushes. So I'm going to chill out here. I'm waiting for the rest of my group to catch up so we can all assault the rocks together. Because there's a big blue four presence up there. We're playing King of Hill. There's no the in it. King of Hill. And you see that green area? That is the hill zone. It's a city, and whichever team has the most players within the city starts earning tickets. Look that guy. Sucks to be him. You just got owned by the bush of betrayal. And now it's time to leave this bush, too. Because I've been compromised once again. Luckily, the chopper's flying away. So I should be able to make it to the top. No problemo. So this is King of Hill. It's... A relatively new game type that is still in beta. Here's a guy shooting Sam. Time to do the world a favor and kill this guy. Yeah. That's what you get for sitting on a rock like you're in the frickin' Lion King with your truck over there. So we got Sam, but I'll take care of him in a minute. King of Hill. Whoever has the most people within the town starts earning tickets first to 200 wins. Usually takes about an hour or so. And... It's still in development. It's in beta. There's only three servers. It's not released to the public. It's just three servers. And it's a load of fun, at least I think. I'm going to go ahead and get up Sam so he doesn't have to trek back over here. Because when you start out, you have a base pretty far away from the, the hill, which is a city. And from there, you have to go into the city. And there's lots of different ways to do that, which is what I like about King of Hill. A problem with armor can be busy work, having to run around. Sam is getting lit up here again. But he killed the guy, so that's good. A lot of the problems with armor often is its tediousness. If I had to run or drive all the way to the hill every time, I would not be playing this. Luckily, they realize that, and they give you lots of different ways to get into the hill. The easiest is teleport to truck. So you have a big cargo truck, each team does, and they can drive it wherever they want. And people in the base can teleport to that truck. So there's a blue four truck on the other side of these rocks, a little ways away. So our mission, our God-given mission, you see it there right there, is to take it out. I mean, we don't have to, but it's something to do. So you can teleport into a truck. You can also teleport onto a person, if you're like me, and you have the speciality, specialization, the spec of spawner. That gives me the option of placing a porta potty in our base, and anyone can walk up to that porta potty, and they will be teleported to me. You can also halo jump into the hill or wherever you want and you can also just be ferried over with a chopper or drive or if you're insane you could walk or run but that would be crazy man talk so we know there's enemies this way in the rocks the blue four truck is down a ways 
So it's not going to be directly in my line of sight. But I know there's guys spawning into the hill area. Because this is getting outside of the actual hill. There's a guy. And they're all, they're all coming in this way. And I need to stop that. So, you see at the bottom right, there's XP, rank, and money. King of Hill is based on a persistent database. So, your stats and rankings are persistent over all three of the server. I think there's three. There might be four. I think there's three. It's persistent all over the server. So every 15 minutes, I think it is, the database saves and saves your rank. And you can see here I'm rank eight. I think it's hard to see. The window's very small for me. Look at this guy. I'm going to blast him right by the soccer field. I didn't get the kill though. So as you rank up, you get the ability to purchase better guns and vehicles. And it's it's really neat. If you want to be a sniper, you gotta pick the specialization of sniper. Shit is hitting the fan here. It's going crazy. So it helps to eliminate everybody just sitting in bushes with their snipers shooting at each other. And I think they just overall do a good job of balancing the game out. Sure, some things are unbalanced, but they're still changing it. It's still in development. So, damn, if guy. you're looking for an Arma 3 competitive game type, I just got snipe. If you're looking for a good game type to try out, try King of Hill. If I'm playing, I'm on server number 2. I'll see you there. Adios. There's actually going to be moments of vulnerability for even the most equipped person. Before, the only people that were unarmed and deemed not a threat were new spawns that had no guns at all. Now... Maybe you run into that notorious bandit on the server and he's eating beans and you run up on him.